How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to Holocure. We are on Suisse today. Let us just jump right into it. Use her old outfit, her brand new one, because why not? Day three. Let's go. Uh, I like Suisse a lot. She's fun to use. I'm fixing my fan. It's hot. Uh, I think she's fun. Uh, I think on easier difficulty, she's actually harder to play because one of her skills revolves around hitting enemies and like a, I, it's hard to explain for me personally but it's more it's like she hits a bunch of enemies and then like I, I, I don't know what I'm just talking about I don't know what I'm trying to explain I find her difficult to use on uh, difficulties where there's not as many enemies there's a path she actually got a buff uh, when, when the game first when the new update came out is that her uh her tetris blocks that fall from the sky can flatten now i suppose it's just her alt being able to flatten which is pretty nice not like super like uh, game changing but it's it's a nice touch uh also this is her alt there's a bunch of Tetris boxes. She's either Tetris Goat. Pretty good Tetris, actually. I haven't watched her play Tetris for a while, but last time I did, I was like, wow. I think the last time I watched her play Tetris was, was a clip where she was played against the number one ranked player in Japan, but lost because it was the rank one person member in Japan. Does it, like... Do you sweep backwards now? Oh, she does sweep backwards. Okay. There we go. Let's increase her, her haste. She hits faster. Block master, that's what we are. Or she is, the block master. Ooh, crit, crit? Sure. Her ult, you guys are always critting. Not her awakening, I mean, not her ult. Her awakening is really good. Grab all these for now. Does that mean she, all her uh, weapon hits are all crits? Crit is guaranteed on the axe, so he deals three times damage. Which is pretty good. So now we we actually never have to upgrade our crit anymore because we're always gonna crit. We have 60 base crit, but now we just always crit with our uh with just with our I think our got here right away. Just with because we're only using our wing weapon, we are always gonna crit, so it's really good. We don't even need to buy a crit, but crit damage is really good on her, I think. So maybe that'll grab Hope Soda. Increase our crit damage even more. Because right now we're don't we have triple damage, but Hope Soda's gonna increase about another 50%. Hollow. Okay. Well, you hit Gorilla's Pox. We don't actually need the crit. You don't worry about. We're not worrying about crit rate. Fifty-three point four. Jesus, the one is so so specific. I should have take off the slow. I don't really need it. We're gonna upgrade the haste. <clears throat> yeah, because we we don't need. If we're doing a solo level, we don't need to worry about our crit rate. But our crit rate's back up to sixty percent. Oh, you did Kusagaki Shackles. I'm dumb. <laughs> forgot about that. I really forgot we had Kusagaki Shackles when I bought, when I got the Gorilla Claw. But, hey, that's fine. It's good. I can grab uh, an energy drink if I wanted to. I do need to get away to heal, though, I think. What do we, do we heal? Where am I healing from? I'm healing from... Beast Path, right? Yeah, defeating targets with actual aided skills, weapons have a chance to heal 3 HP. And, we, and everything's gonna be an actual aided kill, so we always have a chance to heal with 3 HP. I guess we could keep it. Because we could probably could just. I feel like I could probably just heal through just that, maybe. Maybe. Hope Soda. With the extra crit damage. Because <laughs> right now we're sitting at. 20%, we're sitting at 30% boost due to the crit damage stamp and hope soda. And then three times on top of that. I think Nightly Milk would be actually really good on her. We're gonna grab it. Just so we actually have we have more range now. I think it'd be I think it's good for I think Nightly Milk might be good for melee weapons, but that might be just about just about it. Look really close. Oh, the last one I want. I might I might grab nurse horse just so I have it just like something to keep me healthy more uh, reliably or well, not even more reliably to be fair like 
We, have like, we still have a 30% chance, but it's better than, you know, than not having it. We're gonna flatten the big bitches. Ba, 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 ba. I don't even have the uh, solo stamp yet. I just remembered. Actually, wait, no, we don't actually want the that stamp because it's gonna make it so. I think it's gonna make it so it's gonna be very difficult to. I don't know if those are gonna count as actual related kills, but I want to keep not having that. Uh, also, we are at. Uh, we're at. 70% crit damage addition, or additional 70%. It's pretty nice. Oh, flattened immediately. Get fucked, bitch. 80% <laughs> on top of the triple damage. On top of the triple we get already from, uh, from our, uh, awakening. <laughs> don't even have the solo stamp yet, but honestly, we're doing fine without it. Like, it's- she just- Suicide's just that good, honestly. Because of how, like, cause she always crits a lot. Like how, like, we are always, all our hits are guaranteed crits, but like, only some of them are the triple damage crits, it seems. Because the orange ones are from from uh, Hope Soda, so and our crit damage stamp, so very interesting. Bana 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 speed speed. We have for speed on two at thirty HP. I probably can get rid of the crit stamp when I get it when I get a new stamp. But right now we'll get rid of the sun stamp. Oops, I actually didn't mean to ult, but it's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, I think I'll get rid of the crit, uh, the crit damage stamp, and I'll just use it for the solo stamp. I don't think I'll grab the weapon size stamp. I might, though. Just see how much larger we get with it, but... If we, have, if we get insane range with it, then I might keep it. But we have Nightly Milk, so I think we should be fine. All right. Weapon size. Let's try it. You know what? We're getting rid of this step anyway. So keep trying this on. Oh wow, that's a fucking massive. Holy shit! Look at our range and how we have better range. But we don't really need it, so we'll get. Uh, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna. I'll get rid of the weapons uh, size stamp when we get the solo stamp. That's not the solo stamp. That's the gay stamp. The RGB stamp. Pick up range. I don't need crit. I'm not gonna worry about crit rate. Come on. Jesus Christ, our rage is huge. I just, no, I can't sit still. To be fair, I probably could, but whether or not I'll actually survive it uh, is. I don't know. 10% of our HP was 14. Wow. Theoretically, when it says 10%, it should be, so it should always be like 10%, obviously it should always be 10%, but it's not. It doesn't seem like it is. I'm pretty sure it's 10% of your starting HP each time. We'll have to check it. So we got, well, we got 14% last time. We have 14 more HP with the last one I just got. And so theoretically, if it's 10% of your current HP, it would be 15 next. But I think it'll be 14 again. Which I think it just makes which makes sense because it then balances. Because if you get, once you get to like to to like in the 200s, you're doing that's we that's 20. Wait, is that yeah? 
It is 14, yeah. He's 14 each time. For Suisa, anyway. It's 440%. 140. I mean, yeah, because it'd be, it'd be fair. Because it's, not, it's fair that way, because if you're at 200, 200 HP, 10% of your, of your current HP is 20. Then you just can go up 30, 300, it's 30, and then you get to... You can go, it's absurd. Then when you get to 500, you're just... You're guaranteed almost... Like, it takes two level ups, say, to the next one. After you get to 50. It's like, well, that's kind of just cheating. Oh, wow. We, we do need the solo stamp to take care of these things. We still don't have it yet. Which is like, holy hell. Are we gonna go... I mean, honestly, we're doing super fine without it, though. So I'm kind of like... Whatever at this point. We, we, probably, we very much beat this without it. Obviously, I want to get it. Because then it's gonna be a, it's a massive boost to our attack. But like, damn. Ba -ba 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 like we're doing like 500 and some damage with just uh, without it. Like we just 170 attack and our boosts we have now with our stamps and our crits. I can't. I, I think we should. We should. We'll do a whole bunch of damage with uh, with the other one. We should be fine. I think we'll be fine. I need to start like practicing speaking clearly, clearly on camera and on recording, so that when I do script scripted videos, it like sounds good. You know what I mean? Like, I still have that project I'm working on that I'm basically just have to re-go through the script, make sure the script's fine, and then record the script and then edit it. I haven't done either of that because I'm a lazy piece of shit. I just procrastinate so much. Which is my own fault, truthfully, and I really do want to get better with it, but I just, it's, uh, it's tough. I'll get there, I'm sure. Solo stamp, perfect. I am going to get rid of the size up stamp, though, because I don't necessarily need it. Well, it's nice to have that range. I don't, I do not need it. Oh, yeah, we're always, we're doing a like thousand sub damage each time, though. That's pretty good. Hell yeah, brother. Doot doot, we don't want the doot doot. Life seal, we don't want the life seal either. We already have life seal. I like how the six we get is from. Oh, we can flat. We can flatten Shuba. We can't knock back Shuba. I'm gonna take this hit. Okay, I almost didn't take that hit. Oh, wait, that's my fault. We are very much not bulky enough to survive those hits. Okay, never mind. I lied. I will not do that again. Ho ho ho. Ho ho ho. That was dangerous. We almost died. Whoops. Okay. Well, that's not good. Okay, so we. I didn't really. You can flatten the Shuba to stop the, the Shuba and Gellion to stop them from, like, moving, but you can't knock them back at all, which is very interesting. Like, I don't like boss that knockback anyway. I think they always have knockback resistance. Gonna keep increasing our attack to go further beyond. We gotta stop them, Goku. Goku! Nice. Ace two. Ah, delicious. Yes, my project is almost done. Finally. I can go back into streaming. I haven't been streaming to like focus on it, but I also haven't been focusing on it, so I could really could could be streaming. But you know. Mental health issues are also something I wanna work on. So I also haven't been streaming. But I stream later today. Well the day I recorded this. Sunday. Maybe. Possibly. I do need to play for Link to the Past. For undisclosed reasons. But I think I also might make that into a video. I think it could be interesting to have like do like a little montage of the whole game. Like the whole game. So I want to start doing that. I want to start making it so that when I stream, I can turn the all any of those streams into videos, not necessarily into like series videos like I do with uh, like I do with Engage, but more like one-offs. Like I, my friend forced me to play Link to the Past. Yeah, like there's a video like that where I just detail, like, I just like go through the game. It's like highlights from the game, me like in kind of like a mini review of the game. I also want to do something with the reviews too. I think I could probably make a scuffed review ch review videos. I think is something I would enjoy watching. 
The one goes into like not a lot of detail, but like also quite a bit of detail about things I enjoy about the game, things I don't enjoy about games. I think I could do it. I think it'd be interesting, but that's future Xeno problem. Not current Xeno problem. Attack up. I sure we're 13 minutes in. Holy shit. This is still relatively straightforward. I Obviously, the when we get to the magical world, it's going to be difficult because it always does. Uh, this section might be difficult too because we get a lot of enemies. That's why I need haste. I need to get my haste up more because if we get. Okay, cool. We failed it. Now, obviously, I'll kill them in one hit, which is not a big deal, which is great. But the problem is the, uh, <laughs> being a lot of them. 200% attack, no? But I am doing over a thousand damage each time, though. So that's nice. My goal, my, my goal is to try to get over 2,000 damage currently. Like, I'm not going to get, I don't think I'll hit 10k. Like, I already didn't have the achievement for it. Which I, did with, I think I did it with Allie. And her ult gives her insane crit damage. Uh, but the thousand is pretty dual with a lot of characters. I think the thousand, the ten thousand is very specific of who you need to use. Or you just get really lucky with this stuff, but I did it. Not too difficult. Not terribly difficult. Uh, but I guess our goal is to get to 2k, because uh, I think Spider Trima has 55,000 HP. That's about, probably about 50, 45 hits. But we do about 17, 1600 each time. If we want to be like uh, specific, if we want to like give ourselves a good grace period. We can say we're doing 1600 on average, and 16 divided by 50, 55 is like what is it? 55,000. Uh, I don't know. It goes into it three times, so I think it'd be like I think it's 30 total. 1600, 32. I don't know. I think it'd be like 30 something. If you're doing 16, if you're doing, if we did exactly 16, 1600 damage. I was gonna be mixing up their health values. It could be shooting Yelly at 5,000, but I think it has 30, which I think makes sense. Uh, 55,000 on Spider Chama, which I think it gets more bulk when we have Hollow 5, so I think it's a bit more. If that's 55,000, we do 16 each time. Uh, I don't know how to describe it. Because uh, 10 would be 16,000. 20 would be 32. 30 would be 48. Right, to do that right? 20 hits would be 32,000. 30 hits would be 48,000. Because 10 is 16,000. So then... 31 would be 49,600. 49, and then 32 would be 50,000. And 700, 500 and something. So we, I mean, it's closer to 50. 40, I mean. I think I got the math right. 55,000 divided by 16. My final guess is about 36? 30? Oh, I did 16. 34, 37. So 30, but roughly 35. So I was fairly close. Very close. I like how the Tetris box... How, what? what? Critical hits have critical to summon a falling block from above the two hundred fifty. Okay, yeah. Every time we crit, we get more blocks, which, which it's really good. She's very good for crit builds. If her awakening did not give her 
did not give her. I don't know why I went crit up. I don't need crit up. If her awakening did not give her crit up or uh, guaranteed crits on her hit, uh, I guess for solo weapons you don't need crit up uh, wep items. But if you're doing weapons, I would imagine you would want to have crit increasing weapons or items so that you could always be critting. Always, always be critting. We're at 16, <laughs> 69. Nice. All right, we are we are at sixty at base. So I think in, like with just our passive stuff. So I assume you want to get over to like a bit higher. You want you can get items that are pushed over to a hundred percent easily. Those are the pick picky and the GWS spell because when you get the GWS spells, it's probably pretty good. Ooh, there was the these bitches. Time to avoid them at all costs by killing them immediately with one shots because they get tied to one shots. Holy shit! Yago! Sorry, Yago. I'm not focusing on you. Sorry, buddy. Button! He, he didn't drop anything because I used them all up already, apparently. I'd imagine that's what it means. If it doesn't drop anything, I imagine it means you, you, you've you gotten all the stamps already, which is crazy to me. Don't get crit up. We don't want to crit up because we want to stay at the 69% that we are at currently. I need to get a lot of- I need also need to find, like, good background music for my video, for my project. I don't want it just to be, like, me talking the whole time. I want there to be, like, some kind of background music. But I don't know- I'm just not- I don't listen to like, video game music that often, because it's just not my thing. I don't really care for in-game music. I, it wasn't, like, my- the big thing for me growing up. It wasn't, like, a hit or miss. They had a cool music, like, cool, anyway, I'll put my own music on, I'll watch the YouTube video, which I still, to this day, do. But like with Persona, it's like I love that music so much. I just won't listen to it all the time. <laughs> like I, li I listen to it outside. That's how good I. That's how much I enjoy that music. I want to flatten so I can have a bit of survivability. I need to grab that so we can survive it more. Speed. Two seventy for speed. Do a lot of damage. We're doing almost a 2,000 damage. We're almost, yeah, it's 100,000. I think if it was on the endless, I probably could hit to. I probably could get to 20 or to 10,000 if I was on endless. By granted, just by getting a bunch of attack buffs. But. We're not on endless. I think you should be able to. I, should, I think you should be allowed to eliminate stat upgrades. Which sounds weird, but also I think you should just be able to. Maybe you can't do it for like attack and speed. Like for attack, speed, and crit. Or for attack and speed, you can't. Maybe I don't know. I can see why it would be, uh, why it needs balancing. But I think it'd be interesting. Like if you cross a certain threshold with it, you can you just get eliminated. But I also make it so like you only get attack. It'll kind of break the game. So I guess that makes sense. Never mind. Ignore ignore my ramblings. Attack. Oh, I just realized we're nineteen thirty. Holy shit! What the hell? What the hell? You guys don't die to one hit. Wow, they died to two hits. They're bulky little boys. They're bulky guys. They're bulky pigs. Not by much though. Oh, I'm doing two two thousand on average now. That's that should be a lot better. I'm crossing 2,000 mark each time, so it's really nice. The well, Spider-Shaman should be fairly easy to kill now. If it's if we're doing 2,000s now, it'll be like... 10 hits would be 20, 20, yeah. Drop her to the ground! Uh-oh. We tank these, we tank these, we tank these. Told you we tank these! Yeah! Oh, we got cute today. <laughs> Alright, and with that being said and done, let us figure out who we're using next time. So we have we're, we don't have a lot of we don't have a lot of a lot of them to go through. Like we only have 
We actually have no one else from Gen 1 because we've used Hachima, Yozura. No, we haven't used Yozura. Never mind, I'm stupid. <laughs> we've used Hachima, Aki. Wait. Matri's one. Okay, yeah, no, I. Yeah, we need Mel still. Forgot, uh, I think I put, yeah, I put Ayame in Gen 1 by accident. Oopsie. Gen 2, we're done. We're done Gen 2. Kana, that's like the eighth time. I'm sorry, we can't use you anymore. Moomeray, we've already done you too. We've done Miko. We can just do this. No. Sora, perfect. We haven't done Sora yet. She's the last member of Gen 0 we need to do as well, if I'm not mistaken. So well, perfect. We're good. We're good. I like how her special look goes off the screen. <laughs> but anyway, with that being said, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Later!